Hello and welcome to the video how to run Java web project in Apache NetBeans IDE with me, Nam Ha Ming from CodeJava.net. Through this video, I'd like to share with you how to run a standard Java web project that is created in NetBeans IDE. Say, you've got a Java web project from a friend and now you want to run it in your NetBeans IDE. And here are the steps. First, you need to download and install Apache Tomcat, which is a, a web server that is used uh, for running Java web applications. And then, I will show you how to configure run options for Java web project, and also how to configure web browser options. And I suppose that you are using the following software programs, Java Development Kit and Apache NetBeans IDE. First, in order to run a Java web project in NetBeans IDE, you need to have a, a web server. Uh, in this video, I will show you how to download and install Apache uh, Tomcat, which is a popular Java web server. So open the web browser and head over to the Apache Tomcat homepage at this URL, Apache uh, Tomcat.apache.org here. And download the latest version of Tomcat, uh, which is Tomcat version 9 here. And for Windows operating system, download the Windows Service Installer. Okay, the file is being downloaded. Just a moment. Okay, the download has completed and shows in folder. This is the installer program for Apache Tomcat server. I double click to run the installer program. Click next. I agree. Uh, install the default options. Uh, next. And uh, specify the server uh, shutdown port, which is greater than uh, uh, zero here. For example, 9090. And it will install uh, Apache Tomcat Server as a Windows service. So this is a service name and uh, specify the username and password for the Tomcat uh, administrator admin admin and click next and click next install so it should be uh, very simple quick and easy and uncheck these uh, options finish and you will see Apache Tomcat server is installed in this directory program files Apache Software Foundation Tomcat 9.0 here okay this is NetBeans IDE and as you can see I'm using Apache NetBeans uh, version 12.1 here and let me open an existing Java web project Open project. I have an existing Java web project here. The bookstore website project. Okay, the project uh, is opened. This is a standard Java web project uh, based on Java Sublit and on JSP with my SQL database. You can see the web pages and the Java source code here. And uh, you can right click on the project and uh, click run here. And you can see uh, by default it uh, Run uh, Maven build to uh, make a world file. World file is the web archive file that uh, packs the content of a Java web uh, application. And in order to run this uh, project uh, in uh, Apache Tomcat server, uh, you need to configure properties uh, run here. Here you can see uh, no server selected here in the run options here. So you need to add Tomcat server. So we'll go to the menu tools servers here. 
uh, click Add Server button. Choose Apache Tomcat or Toby next, and uh, specify the server location, which is the uh, installation directory of Apache Tomcat server, which I have installed previously in the C driver here. Apache Software Foundation Tomcat 9.0 open and provides the uh, username and password of Tomcat Administrator and click finish and you can uh, configure the server port number here set down port number here uh, choose uh, which java version we run uh, Apache Tomcat here click close and now uh, uh, right click on the project and click run So you see, it uh, starts Apache Tomcat server, and for the first time it uh, asks uh, for the username and password of the Tomcat uh, manager. So provide the username and password in which you uh, uh, specify during the installation of Apache Tomcat here. Okay. And you can see uh, lots of uh, login information in the output view of Apache Tomcat here and you can see by default it opens up a web browser the default web browser is Microsoft S here in my computer and you can see the user interface of the web application here I can browse the book category Java see details of a book here perfect that means the a web application has been uh, running perfectly on Apache Tomcat server right inside NetBeans IDE. You can see the SQL statements printed here. And here you can uh, start and stop the server here. Stop the server. Restart the server. Refresh the server status here. And you can also notice that in the service view here. You can see servers node here and Apache Tomcat here, web application, and you can see the deployed web applications uh, on Apache Tomcat here. You can see the name of the bookstore website project here. So that means you can also manage running server in the service view here under servers node here. Right click in and you can stop, restart server, refresh. Now, uh, when uh, finished uh, testing the web application, I can stop the server here. You can uh, configure run options for this the web project by right click on the project name and click properties uh, run section here, and you can choose the type of the server, the Java EE version, and the context uh, part here, and the uh, browser. Here I want to change to use Chrome here, so I select Chrome here. And uh, uh, as options here, so you can play around with the run options here for the web project. And I click uh, OK. Now I'll we'll run this project again. We'll go to menu file, menu run, run project. So you see, it uh, is quite simple and easy to run a Java web project inside Apache NetBeans IDE. And you see, now this time it uh, opens up a uh, Chrome browser to uh, access the web application here. You see, in the bookstore website application here. You can see details of the book here. Okay, perfect. You can also configure some options uh, for the web browser after uh, running a, a web project here. So go to the menu uh, tools uh, options here, web browser here. Click edit button here. Uh, for example, I want to 
all the way uh, access uh, the uh, web application context path here and uh, followed by slash admin here whenever the uh, project is uh, uh, running so I can uh, configure the options for Chrome browser here when uh, NetBean is there we all the way open the web application with this uh, path here slash admin here and uh, click ok ok and now uh, let me run this web project again Okay, now you see it opens up a uh, Chrome browser with the uh, URL I have configured in the browser options. So I can always access the admin section of the application here. Okay, perfect, right? Okay, so that you have learned how to run a Java web project inside Apache NetBeans IDE on Apache Tomcat server. I hope you will find this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thank you.